Hello and welcome to Trey Practices for the Suit Breakdown. Been trying to get some more practice in with some more of these suits so that I can have them uh, fully figured out for the Suit Breakdown. Some of them I feel like I have a really good grasp on, some of them I feel like I don't really have a great grasp on them. But this feels like the easiest way. I tried to go online with it, you guys didn't get to see that, but uh, I tried to go online against other people. But as it turns out, playing with suits that you're not super comfortable with online is not the best idea. So, you know. Uh, stupid glue gun. Oh, that's a nice combo. This is the melee charge. Oh, there it is, the grab. Okay. Oh, yeah, it's the slide move. Alright. There we go. That feels pretty good, actually. He was a lot more maneuverable than I thought it was. The striker gives off the stun field. There's the grab. I can also use the stun field once I have it fully charged. I don't remember how. It's... Oh yeah, there's the burst. That feels nice. Woo! There's the grab. Oh, oh. oh no, come on. Yep. I have no idea how to use the stun. I'm actually, like, yeah, they're AI, but I'm actually still really amazed that I haven't died yet. I've been around 8 health for a long time now. There we go. Then the meter has to charge again for you to do that. Practice is so tough because of that. Like, I don't want to kill him yet because I want to get that thing charged up so I can figure out how to use it. Such a cool move. Is it? Well, that'd be burst. Oh, that's also burst. It's not those. It's not those. It's not those. It's not that combination. It's not that combination. Killed him with a shot anyway. Go ahead and just keep working on it, figure out how to do that. Other than that, though, I have a pretty good grasp of the O, I think. So what else we got here? What's next? Oh yeah, we're doing all of the Titan suits. That's the next... So, spoilers behind the scenes, but I normally record <laughs> Super Breakdowns in a row. So I can record and edit, like, six of them at a time. Uh, not always. If I don't feel like I'm confident enough with the suits, then I won't. Uh, and I do a lot of extra practice for it then. Uh, but I want, I really want to do all of the, uh, the Titan suits at the same time. Okay. There's the grab. It has a melee combo. Okay. That's really good while I'm moving. All right. So that would be... Okay, that also does the grab, which I I could cancel with my own grab. Doesn't the battle dock also have like a movement skill? Okay, that's not bad. I have some other questions about this grab though. Come here. Come here. Okay, so yeah, I can't cancel out any of the other. I got one more thing I want to try. Come here. Okay, yeah, so I can't cancel out. Alright, let's get the burst to show. The melee burst. Okay, into a nice little melee combo. Oh, it does the grab. That's cool. Okay, yeah. And then just true damage. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Alright, and of course, I can help people if you do it right. What about melee combos? What we got? 
Alright, that's not bad. Back combo. Okay, that's the movement. Okay, that's not bad. Up, 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 but I can't get up. There we go. There we go. I feel like that would do a lot of damage if I could hit with it. I'm also using my bur my boost too fast though. Like I'm burning it out really quickly. There we go. Okay. I had a pretty good feeling for how the, the Biala controlled. Or the bound dock, not the Biala. But uh, I wanted to be sure. Now this next one I don't feel like I have a really good great like great grasp on. But uh, you know, that's what this whole practice series is for. Uh, oh, I actually, I thought the gap play was next. We'll go ahead and do the Masala. I feel like I have a really good grasp of the Masala. No, we don't want the Biala. We want the Masala. Yeah, I feel like I have a really good grasp of the Masala. It's in my, my favorites. So. You know. I must feel like I know what I'm doing with it for it to be up there. Though it's still pretty low level. All told. The flat cannons, really? Ah, oh, come on. Oh, I forgot those were still charging. That's the combo. That's the combo right there. Spin, fire. You dodge out of most attacks with that spin, and then you just go right into the Garobi. There we go. What a burst. There we go. Get up. There we go. Man, I love the Masala. It's a blast to play. It's really mobile, but at the same time, it's really powerful. Although it uses boost really quickly if you go into like your melee combos. And then, of course, there's the wide stun. Oh, some of that damage was blocked because I was a dummy. Oh, come on, Trey. You could have dodged that. Right. Oh, come on. Playing like a rank and file amateur now, Trey. Use the missiles to finish him off. Get the shot in right there. And go in for the melee. Oh! That was so well done! Yep. Oh, he dodged it. Well done. Yep. It is three on one for these practice rounds, after all. I don't normally do that for the actual rounds because I want you guys to be able to see what the suits can do without, ah, uh, come on, without fear of interruption. But for the practice rounds, it actually makes it way more exciting, in my opinion, to have, uh, have it three on one. Oh! All right. We're playing with Grease now. Cooking with Grease? That's the correct phrase. Not playing with Grease. If you're playing with Grease, that'd just be weird. Quick! Because they're behind me! Yep. The range on that is always shorter than I think it is. There we go. There we go. Yeah, the Masala is just a lot of fun to play around with. I definitely don't have it perfect, but uh, I still feel like I have a pretty solid. I feel like I've said that for every one of these. But next up, the, the Gap Slay. And I definitely don't for it. So, you know. We'll see that. Alright. I don't have any of these high level. I don't have mini suits high level. Because I do a lot of practice against AI. 
Which is probably why I'm so bad at the game now, because I just play against AI. And even then, AI beat me up really badly. But my goal is to show you what the suits can do. After I've shown you that, then you can take them and actually be good with them. Right, I don't know the gap play at all, really. Oh, that's not bad. Striker's a melee striker? Okay. There's a charge on this? How good's the charge? Oh, hey, what's up? Okay, it's not bad. Oh, come on, really? Alright, so that's the big beam. It doesn't do that much damage, actually. That's the striker. Not, not bad. Nice little double hit. Oh, come on. Alright, that melee combo's not bad. Here we go, that's one down. Oh man, that was a good sidestep by Emma. Okay. I like that melee combo is a really good setup. But I feel like you can combo into one of these really well. I missed that one really badly. Man, that is not the most accurate thing in the world, is it? There we go. Okay, her melee combos aren't bad. Oh! Oh, the missiles! There we go. Jerado! Yeah, nothing wrong with that. A pretty cool burst. <laughs> I don't know why Camille just let me do that to him, but okay. I'll take it. Oh, it's gonna reload still. Oh, I just stood there and took that. But so did he, okay. Oh, man. Like, the gap play is a really cool suit. I just, I don't feel like I understand it well enough yet. I'll probably practice with it a little bit more before we do some suit breakdowns on it. Alright, next up, the Marasai. I've played around with the Marasai a little bit. I'm not completely alien to it, but... I'd say I'm about half alien to it? Is that is that the scale we're gonna use today, Trey? How alien we are to something? It's got what's probably my favorite sun animation in the entire game. And then that shoulder tackle's not bad. Oh, man, come on. Good job, Trey. Not aggressive enough with the Marasai. I feel like it's a really good like melee unit that focuses a lot on the stuns and then getting in close and doing that. But I don't, I don't do the melee enough with it to, to really showcase what it can do. Oh, hey, what's up, Emma? Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, Emma. What's wrong with that? Oh, man, I didn't even take him down with that either, did I? But it is just a 200 call, so there's that. There yep. Ah, oh, come on! That took my charge, too. There's a stun, though! Ah, the fall. I guess melee is not bad for a 200. It's not bad at all. I like that burst a lot, too. It's, it's very easy to hit with. Even if everything else is not. 
キャミルー I'm tunneling. I feel myself tunneling, but I don't care. I want that Camille. Yep, I was tunneling too hard. I really wanted that Camille. Speaking of which, hey, what's up, Camille? Wow, he is just out of range every time, huh? All right. Oh, come on. Yeah, I set up for that. All right, it's fine. Because that should hit both. Yep. Oh, no, that dagger should have hit there. There we go. Yeah, the Mars size is a lot of fun. I just am not as aggressive with it as I need to be. I'll spend a little bit more time with it. Um, before I do the review. Just so I can get a good feel for the uh, aggressiveness. Like what level I need to be at with the melee. Because it's a fun unit to use, especially for a 200. It's a lot of fun. Alright, next up is the Hyzak. I might go ahead and cover the double theta seats too, just in this training while I'm at it. You need to be scared, Sarah. I don't know the Hyzak at all. Oh, that's cool. But it is still a Zaku, so I mean, it's one of the best suits ever made. Yep. So much damage. Oh, come on, I can't even, like... Shoot, that series. How much damage does that do? Oh, it'd be nice if I could tell. Yep, it'd be really nice if I could get a hit in here, guys. Okay, it does decent damage. I actually didn't expect it to do as much damage as it did. Oh, it's the big gun! Okay, that's a good burst. Alright. I didn't expect big gun to be the burst. Oh, that was wasted just then. Missiles! Got her. Should've sidestepped that, but I didn't. Come on. Is that a stun? Yeah, it sure is! Prepare for big gun! Oh, and I can move it too. That's very useful, actually. I can't cancel out of it, though. That's definitely important to note. You cannot cancel out of it, okay. There's the lowest health one. Oh, he felt those missiles, okay. I actually really like the Hyzak so far. It's a lot easier to use than I expected it to be. Ooh! That did some good damage. And even though it was in green lock, it still hit. It's very useful for somebody like me. He fires too often at Greenlock. I mean, it is a Zaku, so of course it would be really useful, right? <laughs> Alright, let's go ahead and hit the four double Zeta suits. And then we'll probably call it for this one. All right. Full armor, double Zeta. Fire out those missile pods. I did not want to purge my armor, actually. Let's pick it back up. There we go. I mega cannon fire. I actually, this is one that I really need to do a lot of testing on before I do a video for it. To see what all the differences are with the purging armor and the non-purged armor. Because uh, I'm actually not sure... I know that the... Come on. I don't know if that now becomes a shot. Oh, that takes a while to recharge. Oh, wow! Okay, well... Mm. Three enemies is not easy to work against them here. Mega Cannon! 
正気で戦争ができるかこんな状態ダメだあいつをやっつけるまで死ねないスイックデンスが Am I faster without the armor? The strikers are grab Which is one of my melee moves I feel faster without the armor Let's see Yeah And my moveset for melee is different Though I have the grab with the armor on And with the armor I have on I have the full suite of ranged options too Which is, that's a weird I mean it makes sense but it's a weird I can't play around with this anymore Or we're gonna die Purge the armor Go for the melee that we missed yeah, we don't have the high mega cannon with the armor purged. Oh, how did that not finish Abilie off? Oh, man. Alright. 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 Okay. Okay. Gotta get used to it. Gotta get used to it. That's what practice matches are for. So what's the difference between it and the regular one then? Like this variant has the high mecha cannon, right? Basically this training series is where I put in the time to figure out the suits so that I can do the uh, suit breakdown. Right yeah, this version has a different moveset. Oh, okay, yeah, we can separate to be able to attack. But it has to recharge, okay. Oh, wow, that's very nice. That shows you how much I've played with the double Zeta in these games. The double Zeta before was just a 500 suit, so... As you guys know, I'm not really a big fan of 500, so I haven't spent a lot of time with it at all. But the fact that I can do this, the dodge attacks, that's really nice. And then... And then this one's the high mega cannon. That we can also charge this up into, can't we? This is going to be high mega cannon. Yep. There we go. Oh, come on. I was about to... Come on, now. Oh, you ran into it there, and so did Appley. That's not bad. There we go. How do I activate? That was pretty cool. Though. Already, I like the regular Double Zeta way more than the. I would love to know how I activate that other mode, though. Because I can see it over there, I just don't know how to activate it. Come on now. Come on now. Alright, well, we'll figure that out. We'll spend some more time with it. Get that sorted out as well. Oh, nice. You get the glow. Not bad. Alright, now just the two cubalayas. That'll be the practice for today. Come on, Charns and Kurutus. These are also suits that I feel like I've never really understood in the series.
行くぞ行け口の利き方に気をつけてもらおう行け当たれ<笑>よろしく頼む甘いなえ<笑><笑>ファンネル私が出なくてもたくさんつぶし合ってくれそうだねパンネル当たれ邪魔だザコが人類がそれほど賢い存在だと思ってつけつけと人の中に入る And I always wasn't really cool person Although normally it was just me on the receiving end of it パンネル騎士を油断したのかこの私が Come on, ハワンカーやつをここで撃てればハマオカシャアの随配兵ごときに何ができようこれなら何とこれで終わりにするか続けるかもらったな人類がそれほど賢い存在だと思っているのかグレツナ私が誘い出しますお前の時ここまでらしい行くぞ小ざかしいけ今はどんな相手だってわけだ私も神へみたいにやれるおっ、oh, かわっ甘いなパンネルえい Come on We can get her before we die Yes, okay So now We'll try out Purdue 2s and see what's different. Like, I've played around with Hamans a little bit, enough to know how the funnels basically work. But I don't like the way they work, if that makes sense. I gotta play around with some more before I record an actual, like, super breakdown for it. That's a nice one. I like that a lot. Hey, oh, that's all. I've been hit by that many times over the years. So I wasn't sure. oh, okay, that's pretty cool. Oh, yeah, I knocked out of it pretty quick. It's kind of just a slap there. That's all that's got. Yeah, I'm gonna get knocked out of that every time when I'm fighting three people, aren't I? Come on. So that basically just sticks all my funnels on a person while I'm also attacking them. If I shoot my funnels well too, right? Yeah. Man, I just, I really don't like the way these play. Like, it's all built around control, which is something I'm really bad at. Yeah. I can't, I can't even begin to use that well, because every time I try, I forget. Yeah. 
見えてるんだよ And a three on one, that's just not really a good option. Come on, hit her, hit her, hit her. Or hit him, that's Camille. Just because he has a girl's name doesn't mean he's a girl. It's a man's name, and he is a man, I've been told. Man. Alright. Alright. Well, that'll do it for this practice session. I feel like I still don't know anything about most of the double data suits, really. I might have to practice quite a bit on that, but, uh, you know, we got plenty of time. Got plenty of time. I'll get it down. This series is taking a lot longer to complete than I thought it would, but I want to make sure to take the time to get every suit right. So, I mean, we've already done videos on all of these guys, uh, and on some of the DLC suits, so now we just gotta get through all of these guys, you know. You know. We'll get there. But until next time, remember to enjoy, always enjoy the full spectrum. The Gundam Versus has to offer.